New information to this massive fire at an apartment complex under construction in downtown Memphis. While you see the flames bursting from the building along Danny Thomas near Bill Street, it was all going on early this morning. Local 24 News reporter Tish Clark has been at the scene for hours as firefighters contain the blaze. So Tish, what else have you learned about this fire? Okay, well, Katina, thankfully, no one was in the complex when it caught fire. Uh, no one has been hurt. Take a look um, at what it looks like right now. Patrick's going to give you, um, uh, show you what everything looks like so you can get a good idea. Memphis firefighters have been working here since they got the call around 545 this morning, nearly 12 hours now. Several streets, including Danny Thomas, Linden, and Vance, are still closed while crews are here on the scene. MFD got the fire under control quickly, but they They've been here all day putting out hot spots, making sure the scene is safe. We have approximately 43 pieces of fire EMS rescue apparatus, 113 rescue uh, responding personnel. Memphis fire crews have been battling a three alarm blaze at Forum Flats in downtown Memphis since 5.45 a.m. They started on the inside and worked their way out. The four-story Forum Flats apartment complex is under construction. One of the units is an L-shaped building that has 103 apartments. That's where the fire started and firefighters were able to contain the fire and keep it from spreading to neighboring buildings. Memphis Fire is keeping additional resources on hand and if needed. We want to make sure that our firefighters are safe uh, in the event that they need to be rehabbed, they need rest, uh, need water. We check their vital signs to make sure to ensure that they're able to continue on this fire. So we do have additional uh, firefighters on the scene. Okay, so the apartment complex is owned by Elmington Capital. That's a company out of Nashville. We reached out to them and we received an email just a few minutes ago. They say they are uh, thankful no one was hurt, no one was in the complex. They're grateful to first responders for acting quickly and they say they do plan to rebuild in the near future. The project is near FedEx Forum and about a block away from another new project, South City, which Local 24 um, did a story on earlier this week. So the cause of the fire, well, it's still being investigated, so we'll certainly let you know when we find out more information on that. How new technology helped assist Memphis Fire in this blaze? Well, that's coming up tonight at 6. For now, we're live in downtown Memphis tonight. Tish Clark, Local 24 News.